A massive tornado spun up in South Dakota on Saturday and then basically hovered like a spinning top over the same area for at least a half an hour. Because it lingered over a relatively flat area, people could see it from miles and miles away. Our whole county could see this tornado. I mean, there's people from 100 miles away that have pictures of the tornado. You know, they could see it that far here. And for many, it is not exactly a comforting sight to see. There was people that were 40 miles away from the tornado that were paranoid and running for cover and shaking, you know, scared to death. So imagine how Mike Hine and his family felt. The tornado was unbelievably close. I could actually look up at the funnel and I was looking up into it. I was just overwhelmed. I mean, I thought this, this tornado was coming straight at us and we we're going to lose everything. Fortunately, that wasn't the case because while it shifted around a bit, this tornado didn't move a whole lot, which to me is pretty amazing. But there's something else that makes this story interesting. It was the only game in town. This supercell popped up at a time when there wasn't a whole lot of weather happening in South Dakota or even the plains. So this is the kind of weather story I like to hear about. No one was injured, and for the most part, the damage was minimal. But at the same time, it gave people a spectacular view, and maybe even for some, a renewed sense of gratitude. Oh, wow. I don't ever want to see this again, but this is amazing. So thank God, have mercy on us.